good Thursday morning. My kitchen light is still not working. I don't know. The kids are in there getting ready for school. As usual. I need to fix me some coffee. I ran out of my little um uh, Starbucks bottles. Dill was saying the other day, he was like, Co cold coffee tastes like crud. And then I got those little Starbucks bottles. I got the vanilla one. Um, because they didn't have any of the other ones, which I, I think I preferred the vanilla over the caramel. But um, anyways, I just said, you want to try this? And he was like, okay. So he took a drink. And I mean, I don't mean like he took a little sip. Like usually when somebody says, oh, have, you know, taste it. They're like, no, he was like, and I was like, okay, don't drink half the bottle. But uh, anyways, he said, those are actually pretty good. It's kind of like chocolate milk. Which it was vanilla. <laughs> but anyways, I asked him when we went grocery shopping, I said, do you want me to get some more of those? And he was like, yeah, get some of those. So I did, and I had two, and he had two. Sadly, the pack only comes with four. So I gotta buy some more tomorrow, but I'm making my coffee right now. You need know, a little pick-me-up. I tried to go to sleep last night. That didn't work. Because as soon as, like, I laid down... To go to sleep, Dale came in from talking on the phone, and then Riley busted in, and I, it just all went crazy. And I kept having these, like, really off-the-wall dreams. I swear, it happens every time I eat chocolate before bed. Does anybody, do you guys do that? Like, if you have chocolate before bed, do you have, like, really off-the-wall dreams? I do. So, yeah. Very weird. But, anyways, I'm gonna make my coffee and get these kids off to school and then bench talk. So I had to totally laugh. So I get on here after I upload my video and I read and answer, you know, comments and stuff because it's like, why put the computer down, you know, unless like I need to go or just something like that. But it's like, why put it down when I can just tend to it all at once and then go on about my day. I love getting the uh, messages like, oh my gosh, maybe you're pregnant. When I was pregnant, you know, I was so depressed and I was so down and, you know, etc. or I didn't feel good. You know, all kinds of stuff. And <laughs> yeah. so I guess I should probably tell you guys now, let you in on the secret. I am with child. That's right. I am with child. In fact, he's right over there in this little clubhouse. <laughs> Where are you? There he is! There he is! Yeah, he's playing in uh, Preston's little clubhouse. Preston, um, he got this from his little church group. They have this thing where, um, they have, like, a little store. And when you get, like, so many, um, Bible verses said, um, you, like, earn these points per verse. And then you go to their little, like, store, which is stuff that, like, we've all donated, um, for, like, the kids to, like, purchase. So it kind of motivates them to keep working on their Bible verses and stuff like that. And, uh, whoop, <laughs> Preston got that. Which, I had to question it because it was like, why did you get that? Because you're about nine years old and that looks for Riley's size. And then he said that he got it for Riley to play in. And, of course, he and Daniel both try to play in that, like, as much as they can. He's trying to fold it back up. I have Fruit Loops all over my floor. <laughs> so excuse those, but... I don't know, I just had to laugh. I am not pregnant. Oh my gosh, no. I'm not pregnant. My visitor is here right now, that's how I know, and plus you have to do, you know, the stuff to actually have a baby, and I have not, so we stop that, so, yeah, it's not that, guys, but I am getting better, I'm feeling, <laughs> what is your problem, are you feeling better too, now that you've destroyed the house, look, Fruit Loops, yeah, Fruit Loops, ugh, anyways, but I'm feeling a lot better, guys, so, I promise the vlogs will pick back up, but I don't know. I just thought that was funny and I had to like address that. I'm not pregnant. I think everybody like, I don't know why people do that. Like if you say you're feeling nauseous, you're pregnant. If you say, you know, like your pants are fitting anymore, you're pregnant. You know what I mean? Like it's so much stuff, you know, I'm so tired. You're pregnant. You know what I mean? It's just like, oh, I'm not. No, thank you. I, don't, I, I will not have any wine tonight. You're pregnant. No, for one, I don't drink. I drink every now and then, which means, like, I drink maybe once or twice a year. Maybe, if that. Yeah, if that. I just, I'm not a big drinker. 
to me it's just a waste. It's like the way that I see like drugs and alcohol is just a waste. You're peeing and pooping that stuff out. It's just, it's, I mean, you're flushing your money down the toilet, literally. So, hence why I don't do that. I mean, every now and then I like a good margarita. Or every now and then I like, you know, like whiskey and Coke, but uh, I just don't. Or wine every now and then. But I like to cook with wine. I don't go like all hardcore cooking with wine, but um, some stuff I do like to cook with wine, but I don't know. I was saying the other day um, about the shirt that I was wearing that everybody was going to think I was pregnant. And I guess people are taking my shirt because I'm just fat. <sighs> Not fat, I just need ah! Taking that and then everything else, like, you're pregnant. Am I pregnant? I mean, am I? Do you guys know something? I don't know or what? Are you guys just wishing it on me? I hope she's pregnant. I'm not. No. <gasps> are you pregnant? Huh? Are you pregnant? Is there a baby in your tummy? You know, that's Spongebob. That's Spongebob. Don't you throw that. Don't. Yeah, he likes to beat up the camera. We need to clean this mess up. I let him have fun time and play in case you guys are wondering, like, oh my gosh, doesn't she ever clean that stuff up? I do. I think it's important to let your kids just have fun and play and not freak out about every little thing. You know, like, oh my gosh, she's serious on the floor. It's just... It is what it is. It's not going to stain. It's not, you know, like I can just vacuum it up. It's not that big of a deal. It's just important for them to be kids. But he does know when I'm like, you know, now it's time to clean up. He does know that it's time to clean up. You know, like Dale, he is so, oh, he, he would get on my nerves. Back when we first got married, when it was like time to cook, like as soon as he used something, he had to wash it and put it away. And it drove me bonkers. I mean, it just... Oh, and now he still tries to do that sometimes and it drives me nuts because I'm in there and I've got like a rhythm I'm cooking I got stuff going and he's still trying to you know wash stuff and put it away and he's in the way he's making a mess he's stacking stuff here he's moving my stuff around and I'm like where's my spatula and it's just like <sighs> drives me nuts hence why he doesn't cook and because I don't like his food yeah I said it Dale I don't like your food and you know it <laughs> my food last night I will say okay guys I know I'm like rambling forever I will not eat that Korean beef bowl again. I thought it'd be a great different recipe to try. I tried it. I will not eat it again. For one, I went to bed with my stomach hurting and had a headache. And uh, when you like when you would take a drink, you could taste that sesame seed oil. Like I won't try that again. So I don't recommend it. But if you guys want to try it, it's on Pinterest. No, no, no. I swear, there's somebody behind me. It's like I could feel somebody watching over my shoulder. <laughs> He's on the back of the chair. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Check out how cool this fella is with his underwear on. Huh. Yeah, he even has his shirt tucked into him. <laughs> He's looking good. Huh. So I mean serious business here. Don't. Oh, you almost got him. <laughs> <laughs> he just got up from his nap. Yeah. He was not very happy. Had to change his diaper. And I'm trying to potty training again I got him some um some potty in the nams oh no you guys would be like what but anyways uh with the younger ones every time it would go potty in the potty I'd give them a little m and but now they have like these mega ones that are like that big so it's gonna work out um just fine for him but uh, we've been like going to the potty and stuff he hasn't peed in it yet but he just peed in the floor actually so I was just scrubbing the floor with my freshly painted nails and stuff put another coat on this hand but I kind of have to wait <laughs> just for a few minutes <laughs> so he's wanting juice he just peed in the floor but he wants juice 
All right, and there's my Molini. I switched it up just a little bit tonight. I haven't tasted it, so I don't know. He's eating it though, so it must be pretty good. Good. Preston, have you ate it? Okay. Yeah. Have you eaten any? Good. Riley, just sucking down the juice. What? All right. Well, anyway, I'm gonna no. taste mine, and I'll tell you guys if I like it and what I did differently to it. But that's what it looks like. Close up. Here we are again. <laughs> uh, well, the mystery ingredient in dinner was sour cream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've been putting sour cream in everything, but anyways, it's pretty good. I mean, changes some stuff up. But I took a shower, so I'm all nice and cleaned up, trying to relax. The kids are in there watching Spy Kids. I just read uh, Brody's book to him. Dale's asleep on the couch. <laughs> nothing new there. But. I guess I'm going to go ahead and say goodnight because there's nothing interesting going to happen from this point on other than me laying down trying to sleep. But I'll say goodnight and see you guys tomorrow. Night, guys.